Hello there, I am Giant Crowd with more Earthbound. In the last part, we got through the Butcher's Factory. We drank some coffee from him, given by Mr. Saturn. We had a little realization, a little message for us, I guess. And uh, we also got the Mr. Saturn coin. Now, I had to redo the Butcher's Factory, or more, like the majority of it, uh, off screen because my save file, um, apparently, I may not have saved after the last uh, part. and. I was like level 28, I was like, wait, I should be level 30 in my save file. But then I was like, oh man, I may have not saved, and I don't know. It could also be, have to do with like my save seats and stuff. But I don't know, but I had to go research, we, we did my, um, the whole Belgius factory almost, except for a little bit actually. The majority of it, as I said. Um, I do it, I'm at level 30 for Ness, level 27 for Paula, and level 26 for Jeff. I think that's where we were by then in the last part. Some of the stats might be different. I mean, well, none of the levels might be different. I've also remembered to give the vitality capsule to Ness right here. So his vitality is 16 right now, so that's good. I gave the Mr. Saturn coin to um, Paula again for her um, other on her equip menu. And let's just, I guess we can talk to Mr. Saturn and like get, take a nap, I guess. Why not? Do you want to slumber? Yes. KO. And I don't know, it's kind of weird, but maybe, um, Jeff will, okay, never mind. Jeff might repair another weapon, but as you saw right there, he didn't, so we'll have to just wait for that. Because I think after the stun gun, he gets, like, the laser gun or something, which is really good. So hopefully, in the near future, he can actually, um, he'll get that and stuff and get that repaired. Oh man, I, I, I totally went the wrong way. Should, oh, I should have gone up the ladder. Yeah, um, I'm gonna withdraw uh, $18 from the tel automatic teller machine, the ATM, real quick, because I want to call Cargo Express to pick up three items, and I know three items to actually uh, store using that service. So withdrawal. I only have $2 on me right now so far, so yeah, there we go. And we should put, bring up a, um, we should talk to pick up the receiver and call Cargo Express. Hey, well, this is Cargo Express. Oh, is that your nest? Big bro, it's me, Tracy. I'm working part-time for the Cargo Express. What can I do for you? I want you to send a guy to pick up items. Is that what you want? Something for you? Um, I forget. I must have read that. I kind of clicked too fast. We'll send someone over immediately to pick it up. Click. Okay. That's cool. So it shouldn't take long for the guy to get here. So I'm just going to try to go over here because that's what we need to do. Press to progress in the game, go up that ladder right here. And we go up the ladder. Up, oh, he's he's coming. He phased. Right, he walked right through that semester Saturn. Hello, this is Chicago Express. Your delivery charge is eighteen dollars. Can you cover the bill? You can cover the bill, right? Yes. What do you want me to take? I can take up three other things. Okay. So let's see. We don't need the backstage pass because the runway five was back in Tucson, and they're kind of not with us right now, so we can store that. And we can store the pack of bubble gum that Jeff has. So. We don't really don't need that for now. We can just stash it away. And then finally, the bad key machine that Jeff has. We don't really need that either, so we can put that away too. Okay, let me just confirm your request. You want me to just take the backstage press, the pack of bubble gum, and the bad key machine. Is that correct? Is this correct? Yes. Alright, certainly. Thanks a lot. And he goes off. Okay. So now we want to go over here. I'm going to read the sign. Whole. Whole. Uh, milky well what's what this do what's this ding ding okay so we're gonna run into a couple new enemies here um one's kind of made fun of because it's like ron boob or something the enemy name and okay there's one right there and then we also run into different like evil mushroom these ones up here are gray instead of uh, not gray but green instead of the red, other mushrooms evil that evil they're red and then we also have a tough mobile sprout so I'm gonna go with the, um, yeah I'll go, yeah, Tough Mobile Sprout, the Strut and Evil Mushroom A, which is green instead of red, the Ron Boob, and then another one of those Strut and Evil Mushrooms. So I'm gonna like, start with using PK, uh, not PK, PSI Rock and Alpha, and then uh, PSI Fire Alpha for Paula, and then Jeff can shoot the Tough Mobile Sprout, I guess. You know, Tough Mobile Sprouts are just like more defensive and more offensive, I believe. No, he's spreading, you know, mushrooms around in events. Feeling strange, no. Yeah, okay, we got, we got this though. We can take these guys out. 
to dinner at um Texas Roadhouse. No shit. Yeah. You stop moving tough mobiles for that. Good for you. Another PSI Rock and Alpha. Another PSI Fire Alpha. And then Jeff can shoot the Stretch and Evil Mushroom A. No. Jeff got poisoned. I'm gonna have to heal him after this battle. Paul is feeling funky. No. We don't want that. Okay, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Jeff is now level 27. Offense went up by 1. Speed went up by 1. I got someone up by 1. IQ went up by 1. Maximum HP went up by 1. So yeah, I don't think we can heal the mushrooms unless we get to the hospital, but we're nowhere near hospital, so that stinks. Healing beta on, uh... Jeff, I guess, because he wants to heal some poison, right? Yeah, there it goes. Jeff was removed from Jeff's body. The poison was removed from Jeff's body. Cool. So, there's another Ron Boob and two mobile sprouts that could sprout more tough mobile sprouts. Okay, PSI Rockin' Alpha, um, PSI Fire Alpha, and Jeff can shoot the tough mobile sprout A. No, not a shield. That's actually pretty good then, because I don't think you can deal damage. Well, depending on the circumstances, may may work and may not. I think that's how it goes. PSI Rock and Alpha. Yeah, the, full, the top one was about eight. Stop moving. Okay. Um, Bash. Um, I'm gonna just use PSI Fire Alpha, and then uh, Jeff can shoot the um, top one was about B, so he can't sprout anymore. Uh, allies, I guess you could say. Teammates. Because they're, they're on the dark side. The evil... Okay, yeah, this will definitely take out them tough mobile sprout. Hopefully, Jeff, yeah. No, I didn't nest. No. Dang it. Oh, no. That's not good. No. There's not going nest. No. This is bad. Okay, yeah. If you're on funky, so they accidentally hit their own teammates. So, yeah, they 2072 experience, I think. Ness is in all of 31. Offensive by 1. Speed went up by 1. Vitality went up by 2. Ooh, cool. IQ went up by 1. Sweet. Maximum HP went up by 30. Um, uh, maximum people went up by 5. That's a pretty good level up. Um, I guess I could heal Jeff. He's feeling a little low on H uh, HP, yeah. Yeah, just to get him back in the hundred range, triple digits. That might I, I might I'll heal Paula too, just in case. Oh man, he's she's already at max HP. Okay, better safe to be than sorry, you know. Here's another Ron boob. Yeah, let's just battle. Let's just battle. Okay, PSI Rock and Alpha. PSI Fire Alpha and Jeff can shoot the Evil Stress and Mushroom A or first there's one not really A but like ooh shoot oh man that's not good this is not good at all they did high damage on us I'm afraid of attacking because maybe it'll hurt us again. Or I'm not really sure. I'm just not sure. Yeah, that was stretching evil mushrooms that moving. I mean, we're, we're in a little, we're in a little bit of trouble right here. Okay. Yeah, that's that wasn't that was close. Ness and his friends gain 1,948 experience each. Pause in level 28. Oh baby, offense went up by 3. Defense went up by 1. Oh baby, speed went up by 3. IQ went up by 2. Maximum HP went up by 2. That rocks. Maximum HP went up by 10. So another good level up. Okay, so I'm gonna PSI heal one again. Basically on everyone. Yeah. Okay, everyone looks 
good, I guess. Another rotten boob. These things are like, I'm gonna mess with you until you can't take it anymore. That's basically what they're saying, if they could talk. PSI Fire Alpha, PSI Rocket Alpha, and Jeff can shoot the run boobe. Ah, uh, his body's protected by light, I think, or something. I oh, mean, that stinks. Hopefully, my. Okay, I don't have enough HP. Okay, I'm gonna just natural bash the run boob. Probably use PSI Fire, and Jeff will shoot the run boobe. Yeah. Here we go. Nice. Another one. That's just one though, so that's good at least. A bash, PSI fire alpha, and shoot the run boop. Bash, bash, and shoot. Yeah. There we go. Nice. Now since funds get 829 experience each. Cool. I'm gonna use P oh no, I don't have enough PP for um, another PSI heal and alpha. Okay, here's an item. And so in the present, uh, there's a coin of slumber inside. Paul takes it. And I want to give that actually to Jeff if he has room. Does Jeff have enough room to... Yeah, he does. Okay, cool. So, let's see. Um, coin of slumber. I want to give that to Jeff, actually. So, give it to Jeff so I can equip it. And equip. Go to Jeff's menu. And I think it's other. Homicide is that gives us the HP defense of 42 right now. If I had such a coin of slumber, it raises it by 20 from 42 to 62. So, that's really good. And Jeff could use some more defense, I guess. So, it's a win-win situation. Okay, so I'm gonna end the part right here because this is where the Sanctuary boss is, another Sanctuary boss is. So this has been Janko again. Uh, so this has been the my, end of my Earthbound Let's Play part, and next part we'll do just that and take on the Sanctuary boss. So this has been Janko again. I would like to thank you for watching again. Goodbye, and I'll see you guys next part of my Earthbound Let's Play.